Hi, I'm Federica Smith-Roberts and I'm the leader of Somerset West and Taunton Council. Welcome to our annual plan. The annual plan is part of what we call our golden thread that links our longer term priorities right through to our own staff's objectives in order that we are all pulling in the same direction. It doesn't contain everything we do, but it sets out at a high level the key projects and actions we intend to focus on during the next 12 months. These are in addition to delivering the excellent day-to-day -day services that you as a community rely on. Last year, the council was ranked as the top performing district council for our plans around tackling the climate and ecological emergency. We have once again prioritised our climate work within our budget. In this year ahead, we are going to focus on several projects. The rollout of further electric vehicle charge points, completing the switch of our own cars to electric, commencing the decarbonisation of our council-owned homes. We will be producing an ecological vision and action plan for the whole district and delivering the first phase of Taunton Town Centre cycling and walking project, linking the railway station to Vivery Park. Attracting jobs and unlocking sustainable development opportunities are vital to the long-term prosperity of our district. This coming financial year, we will complete our major regeneration project at the Coal Orchard and the commercial spaces and homes will be occupied, bringing a new vitality to this part of Taunton Town Centre. We are going to see a significant amount of construction take place on our Firepool site, with the construction of a digital innovation centre and the creation of the Western Boulevard. We will see additional planning applications come forward for Firepool. We will work with partners to identify a long-term strategic solution to the phosphate issue and to progress the delivery to enable sustainable phosphate neutral development within Somerset. We will look to identify suitable employment land within West Somerset, undertake a wide range of economic development initiatives including attracted inward investment, a programme of cultural and town centre events, employment hub and workforce upskilling. We are also going to complete the next phase of the business case development for Wellington Railway Station. We know that having a clean, tidy and welcoming town centres are important to you and it's important to us as well. For 2022 to 23, we have allocated £50,000 for a deep clean of our main town centres and other high football areas. We are going to roll out a new enforcement scheme targeting those that litter our streets and public spaces. We want to help local people find a place to call home that they can afford. In the year ahead, our first tenants will start to occupy our brand new council homes in Priorswood Taunton. Work will also be well underway on our 54 new council homes in Seaward Way in Minehead. We will have commenced work on building further carbon neutral council homes for rent on six other sites across the Taunton area. We will also continue to work with housing developers and partners to deliver a further 200 to 300 affordable homes. We will also want to continue to protect the most vulnerable residents in our communities. This year we are going to acquire further properties to provide additional bed spaces for people who are experiencing homelessness to give them the time, space and support to help them get back on their feet. We aim to work with partners to deliver further pantries in our district, providing vital help to those who are struggling to put food on their tables. We will also maintain our funding to community and voluntary groups in our district to help them carry out their vital work. This year, sadly, is going to be our last year of operation as Somerset Western Taunton Council. From April 2023, our services will be delivered by the new Somerset Council. We have a lot of work to do in this last year, as we need to prepare for the safe handover of our services to the new council. And we will continue to carry on with and finish the work to create a town council for Taunton, to give Taunton a council to act as its champion once the district council has been stood down. We want to leave a lasting legacy based on everything you expect from us as a council so that this area continues to be a great place to live, work and visit. <laughs>